People dying to hear what I got to say. Who wants to start? <clears throat> All right, appreciate it. <laughs> It's going good. Uh, we're working hard. There's definitely a culture that we're trying to build. Um, I like the way we're heading, but uh, a lot to improve on. And we got really high expectations for ourselves, especially as an O-line and everything we're trying to do offensively. So um, heading in the right direction. Just, you know, we got to sure up a couple things. There's some guys during camp from the O-line. How does that help you with all costs? How does that hurt you going into this Yeah. Um, I mean, regardless, just as an offensive lineman, as a pro, you got to be ready to play next to whoever they put in, you know, by you. And um, it, it's good to see younger guys get reps and learn what it's all about. And, um, yeah, it, 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 it's good work, it, especially as an older guy. It makes you have to think a little more and um, builds your, you know, game as well. So, uh, like I said, heading in the right direction. Um, just got to keep working, keep climbing each day. New staff, new focus, you know? Um, yeah, I, I'm loving the new staff. I love our philosophy offensively, uh, the mindset, what we want to do, run the ball, all that stuff. And um, now it's just about executing it. You know, we can talk about all of it, but now we got to go out there and prove it. And uh, that's just every day on the field working. And I know we're putting in good work and just going to keep building with time. Yeah, I think I think we do a good job in practice of simulating it. So um, just keep, you know, repping those looks, getting your uh, body, your technique, your mindset, everything acclimated, that kind of stuff. And um, it's going to carry over to Sunday. And, we, you know, we make that a big point of emphasis that, you know, we want to outwork everyone we're playing. So that that's what training camp's for. So that's what we're we're building up to right now. Do RB one of the backfield for a third, fourth time, you know, consecutive years? How do you guys kind of embrace them and, and take that role and, and move? You know, how's it all like, all that click? I guess. Yeah, um, kind of similar to you know whoever's playing next to you on the line. It, it it doesn't matter who we put in there. As an offensive line, our mindset is we're going to create opportunities for whoever's back there to make plays. Because we, we have athletes. Like, there, there's no question about that. We have guys that can make plays. And now let's put them in those situations where, you know, let them shine. And um, we're building towards that. We, um, you know, I feel like as a group where, you know, guys are getting a better hold of the offense and understanding, you know, what is the design? What are we thinking on each play? And, um, yeah, I can see it coming together. Sorry, Pete. Yeah, definitely. Matt, uh, he, he's definitely been one of the guys that I've seen just taking a big jump this year. He, even just his demeanor in the building, his confidence, how he's carrying himself. Um, man, it, it seems like he's even having more fun, too. So that, that's a good thing. And uh, I think he's doing a really good job. He's a smart guy. He's getting us in the right position on plays. And, you know, as a center, you you got a big, you know, task ahead of you with calling out everything and making sure us five are uh, set up for success. and. Um, he's definitely, definitely heading in the right direction. Uh, are you kind of looking forward to the, the preseason games? Because I know y'all didn't have it last year. This is such a huge and different instance thing that you're going into where it's like, this is a new coaching staff. Y'all don't know how they work on a game day. I mean, is that stuff that y'all are going to consciously think about when you're going through these preseason games? Sure, I think, yeah. Last year, I mean, no question was weird, just going straight into real football. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, a, I'm glad we got, you know, preseason back, you know, workout kinks, get used to, um, like you said, with new staff, what's it going to be like, what to expect. And, um, yeah, I think we're preparing and uh, planning on doing a lot of good things and setting ourselves up for, you know, a successful season. Do you like where things are in terms of the pace of the install? Do you, all, do you feel comfortable with where you all are now, I guess, it's like, what, 10 days into camp? Yeah, definitely. It's... Um, we got a lot of stuff in. Uh, this is kind of a point where, especially, you know, if you're new to this or younger guy, your, your head can kind of start spinning a little bit. But, um, you know, I think for the most part, we're handling everything well. There's always going to be things you want to, you know, fix. But, um, 
you know, I can't say enough, you know, starting with Hennessy at center and, uh, you know, us, us five up front, we're doing a good job communicating and making sure we're on the good, you know, right page and, um, you know, not satisfied though, we got, you know, a long way to go. Yeah, well, you know, the first thing I noticed with him, he's, he's very talented. Um, I think he's going to be a good player. Uh, you know, obviously, like you said, with Caleb out, he's you know playing right tackle now as a rookie, and that, that's a hard thing to do. Um, you know, I, I was in the same position my rookie year. I remember doing that, and it, it's tough. Like I said, we're we're you know ten days in now. We got mostly offense in, and your head's kind of spinning. So um, with him, it's just improving daily, and um, you know, you know, kind of, we kind of talk about feeling comfortable with each play, knowing what are we doing, what's the design, you know, the bigger picture of just I'm blocking this guy. So um, yeah, he's coming along, and you know, as, you know, as a a vet is an eight-year guy. Um, you know, it's my job to bring him along, and so yeah, take a lot of pride in that. Anybody have anything else? All right, thank you. All right, thanks, guys.